Padres, si su hijo ha llegado a la casa quejándose de bullying, no reduzca el problema a una cosa de niños y preste atención. En entrevista para Reporte Índigo, John Halligan, padre de familia estadounidense cuyo hijo, Ryan, se suicidó en 2003 luego de haber sido víctima constante de bullying y cyberbullying durante la escuela secundaria, advirtió a los padres que tienen que manejar la situación, que no asuman que el bullying no es para tanto, ni den por sentado que esto va a desaparecer, ni le digan a su hijo que solo lo ignore, deben controlar el problema y detenerlo tan pronto como comience. can't address this problem without involving the bystanders, the audience, because at this age, uh, a lot of the bullying that occurs, the motivation, the incentive is the audience. They're getting a reaction from the people around them. And we've got to teach that group, the audience, not to be the audience, you know, that, that they have a role that they can play rather than stand by and let somebody else get bullied and say nothing or, or even laugh. Um, That's not acceptable. You've got to treat this as a community problem, okay? Not an isolated problem. It's a, it's a whole school community. You've got to involve not only the kids, but you've got to involve the teachers, the administrators, the bus drivers, you know, anybody, the cafeteria workers, any adult that comes in contact with a child um, should receive some level of training on this issue and how to, how to intervene and deal with it.